Want to turn your content from boring to jaw-dropping? Watch as I transform reality with VFX in Blender. To get started, you will need Blender, a whole lot of patience, and the video clip that you will be using to create VFX. Once you've got your clip loaded in a free program called FSpy, this program helps us calculate the perspective of the camera. Just draw your perspective lines, then export to Blender. Firstly, import your FSpy scene. You then want to select your camera, and under Camera Properties, enable Background Images. Here, you can upload your video clip. Once the background image is set up, we can then create a ground plane to see if the perspectives match. If they do not quite line up first try, you can always adjust the angle of the camera inside Blender. I then want the ground plane to be invisible, but to also receive shadows of other objects to make the scene more realistic. We can do this by moving to a new collection and selecting Shadow Catcher under the Mask tab in the Visibility Properties. As you can see, now we have shadows. Adding a sunlight will allow you to control these shadows by adjusting the rotation of the sun and by adjusting the intensity of the light. As this is a video clip, the camera will move slightly, so the next step is to motion track the camera in Blender. I did this manually by keyframing the camera's position and rotation every 15-30 frames. First, we'll need to block out the main building. This will help us keyframe the camera's movement as we can just line it up to the video. We can also use these objects as masks if we want 3D objects to interact with them. Just enable Holdout under Visibility. Now let's import this little guy. Finally, before rendering, let's add another plane here so that the alien will cast a shadow on the building. Again, enable Shadow Catcher in Object Properties. Quickly slap on some Cortez. Clint, if you see this, let's work. And there we have it. Follow me for more 3D content. DM me on Insta to work.